Hey there, welcome to Grateful Kids. Today we're going to draw a perfect heart. Like subscribe for more other art lessons like this. So all you need is a piece of paper and you can have a pencil or I will be using a marker. Anything that you have around that you can use. And what you want also is something that is a circle and something that has a square edge. So this marker container works perfectly but you can find a book or something that has this perfect angle right here. Okay, so first of all just watch me and then you can make your own heart. So what you're going to do is you're going to grab your thing that's a circle and you're just going to go to the left here a little bit and go around your circle. And you're going to fill this in so it doesn't matter if it's perfect. And if you have pencil you'll end up erasing these lines. And then you're going to overlap those lines. So you're going to make this kind of loopy loop and it doesn't matter how big or small your loop de loop is okay you just want to make sure that this is going to match up with that edge and that edge and then just go around this okay then you grab your straight square edge and you see this point right here what you're going to do you're going to draw a line going down, okay? And somewhere on this line, you're going to end up making a square with this. So you're going to put that point on there, okay? And you're going to keep going down, 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 until you don't see your circles anymore. But then you lift up a little bit because you want to see just the very edge. And then you follow this line and you follow that line. So all you needed is a square and some circles and then that's a perfect heart then you can make your your lines a little bit better here and fill them in. And there you have your perfect heart and you can go ahead and color this in or if you've done this with pencil you can erase all of these lines and then you have just your outside line. Gorgeously perfect heart. And just using things that are around because I know you guys probably don't have a whole bunch of measuring tools. But if you do, measuring tools work too. Okay, Conrad's going to give it a try. You can go ahead and watch him while I color mine in. use this as a tool to make a straight line. Good job. Okay, you want to make yeah, you want to make this straight line go to that. See that point right here? This point and this point. You want to line that up. That's where your straight line should be. It should go between those two points. Yep. Then do you remember what to do next? Um, go like right here and we can just 
Billy. Yep, so you want to make that edge go there and then you kind of s s twist it around until you have just a little bit of the sides. Okay. See how you have just a little bit of the sides there? And then you make sure that this is right on that line. And then that's your perfect point. You kind of have to hold things down real good. So hold this down. That's one of the key things. Because if it moves, then you mess up your heart, huh? There you have your perfect heart. You can color it in. Here's our perfect haul. We hope you had fun. If you did, give this video a thumbs up and let us know in the comments below. And be sure to subscribe for more art lessons like this one. And we will see you soon. Bye. Bye.